On May 28th of 2016, a young child fell into the gorilla enclosure at the Cincinnati Zoo, leading to an ape named Harambe picking up and dragging the youngster around. While this may have just been a headline of the week in another era, in the internet age it became the biggest meme of the year. So whatever happened to that beloved gorilla? Well, before we get to that, let's first get a bit of context. You have to understand that at this point in time, there was a lot of talk about the treatment of exotic animals. Another clear example of this would be Cecil, a very popular lion that people traveled to see in Zimbabwe and was being observed and tracked. Things went wrong when an American hunter killed the creature during a guided tour. Backed by internet outrage, a witch hunt ensued, with activists, musicians, comedians, and actors coming forward showing their disdain for trophy hunting. Soon people discovered that the identity of this hunter was a dentist from Minnesota, who was getting so much hate that he had to close down his practice. As we could see here, the World Wide Web has no problem going against people who mess with animals. Our main topic began when the three-year-old who witnesses said was talking about wanting to get into the Gorilla World enclosure did just that. As he slid in, zoo workers quickly attempted to get the gorillas back indoors so they could retrieve the young boy. But Harambe did not listen. The animal proceeded to drag the child around the enclosure as well as try to prop him up as onlookers watched in terror. The video of the incident has been viewed over 13 million times on YouTube alone. People were mad at the child and felt that the parents should be held accountable for letting their kid disturb this peaceful animal. In the following days, over half a million people signed a Change.org petition, saying that they should face consequences for their negligence. Eventually, the outrage made its way onto the streets. Uncontrollably. You may not believe it, but because this was such a popular headline, some online started to make jokes about Harambe which the people over at the Cincinnati Zoo did not find humorous. To get people to knock it off, they asked everyone online to stop with the memeing, which is probably the worst thing they could have done. People don't like being told what to do, and in response to the zoo's requests, they just picked up the pace. Running this meme into the ground turned into a meme itself, and people across the world shared in the humor. It took some time, but eventually the memes did calm down. The sad news is, which I didn't realize until now, is that Harambe had been killed by a gunshot wound, ending his beautiful life. In memory, yesterday Elon Musk released a rap song to pay tribute. So there you have the sad story of Harambe. While he may be gone in physical form, he'll always be remembered right here. Just like a baboon. 